Uh, our involvement as an organization in this uh, AMCOMET meeting about meteorology is guided by three main issues. The first one is that in Africa, the main important disaster are caused by climate-related hazards. It is about floods, it is about drought and related food security, it's about meningitis, which is related to dry condition, it's about malaria, which is related to weight condition, then uh, a lot of spectrum of disaster in Africa are caused by uh, climate-related hazards. The second issue is that there is a change in the, uh, the methodology in which we are working as disaster risk manager. Before, we were looking at the past to establish a trend and try to imagine the future trends. Today, with the climate variability, the past did no, does no more explain the future. Then we need a strong linkages with climate science to anticipate disaster and to understand the changes. What does mean climate changes in order for us to provide strategies and support government and local government, including mayors, to develop a climate adaptation strategies? The last thing is, we, in Africa, we are a bit more advanced than other continents. Why? We, uh, we have already what we call climate outlook forums. It is organized by ACMAD in West Africa, by ICPAC and IGAD in East Africa, by SADEC in the Southern Africa. In, in climate outlook forums, it's a forum in which we brought together the climatologists and the main end users. The main end users are agriculture, as I said, for food security, health, um, water resource management, you know water is a, a very strategic product in Africa, and we try to establish a dialogue and uh, try to understand which knowledge are needed for the future and which knowledge exists already to be used in our programming. Today we are entering in new uh, uh, qualitative program programming for disaster risk reduction and climate change adaptation, which uh, is based on climate science and climate knowledge.